Hello once again. This is Jerry and we will now continue our discussion with DB2 Express tutorial. On today's session, we will concatenate columns, check null values, and sort rows using order by clause. Let's begin. You may combine two or more columns and put it on one derived column. You use concat function, short for concatenate, to achieve this. Notice that in most of our examples, last name and first name are in separate column. We may designate column name name as a result of concatenating the two columns. Connect first with our database server. Connect to sample. Let us try this script. Here is our result. Since concat is limited in combining two columns only, we nest it with another concat to combine first name with last name added by a comma. Comma here is considered a column that is why it is enclosed by two single quotes and not double quotes. At the end of the concat functions, we have the alias name name for the operation. As alternative to concat function, you may use two pipe symbols to concatenate columns. If we are to combine last name and first name with the comma separating it, we have the following script. This is the output. When a column contains nothing, even a single space, it is considered null. Some columns are restricted to contain a value and some are allowed to be empty or null. Let us try this script. When you check the content of department table, you would see dashes on MGR number. To filter null value, we enter this script. There you are. How do we sort rows? The way records are installed in a table is entered in simultaneous manner. Nevertheless, we could present the list arranged according to our specification. This is the syntax on how to sort either by ascending or descending. In order to sort rows by last name in alphabetical order at employee table, we issue the following script. Here we specify the column of what will be the basis of the arrangement after order by. Last name here is used to sort rows in ascending order. How about if we want to display in descending order with the same set of columns from the previous example? Let us modify our script. We 
did not specify A is C for ascending order in our first example because that is already the default of order by clause. If you want to display in this reverse order, use DESC after the column subject for order arrangement. Sorting is not limited with one column only. You can sort multiple columns depending on which column to sort first before proceeding to the next column. The next requirement is to display employees by working department, last name, first name from the employees table. The sorting script on this case is This is the output. As you notice from the previous script, the list is sorted according to work department and then by last name in ascending order. The sorting of column in the order of priority is separated by a comma. Instead of a column name, you may replace it with a column number. The previous example has three columns on each script and sorted according to work depth and last name. Work depth is defined as column 1 and the last name is column 2. If we sort according by column number we have, we achieve the same result. You may also sort according to computed value. On our problem, let us determine the length of service in years of employees. List employees' last name, first name, hire date, and computed value length of service, then sort according who stayed most to the list that rendered service. This would be our script. This would be our output. Here we computed first the length of service, then sorted it according to computed value from highest to lowest. Be aware of the syntax when working with where with an order by clause. Where should come first before order by. Let us determine the highest paid employees of the company. List last name, first name, job, and salary. We sort salary in descending order and exclude president and manager position. If you like to see the script of the video presented, please click the link below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it with your friends. Buy the book for more challenging exercises with solutions. Visit our Facebook and Twitter account. Bye!